Hi boys and girls, this is Lily. This is a start to finish um, 12 by 12 layout. So I am going to start with um, a recollection black 12 by 12 sheet of paper. And then I am using my DCWV um, designer's paper. And this deck is called the Prime Rose. Um, it has a lot of beautiful pages and this really pretty tags that you see right there down below. So I'm using this beautiful picture of my daughter I took here in the scrap room. I am using recollection paper um, as the photo mat. Also, I am going to use this um, pop dots for the picture. <clears throat> and they're called um, foam adhesive squares. And it's recollection brand. So what I'm making, I'm getting this, um, the designer paper. Um, cutting the edges because my blade is a little bit... Um, it's not sharp, so it leaves um, shabby chic edges somewhat. So I'm doing that to all the edges. I made it smaller than the page, and this page I'm going to do the same exact thing as the blue one. I'm going to cut all the edges so that it looks shabby chic and rugged since the blade is now good. And um, the blade is just working with me at this point. <laughs> um, I had a little bit of malfunction with my ATG tape, but that's okay. We just keep on rolling. I used a hot glue gun from now on. So I just cut off a little bit right there in the side, and I used my Tim Holtz um, Distressed Ink so that it looks better. And right here, I'm just going to make a couple of little designs with the paper, and it's looking really, really nice. This paper, I have to say, it's been a while since I've seen um, a lot of pages inside one of these uh, books that I like. Um, lots of beautiful designs, so I went ahead and I got full, this um, 12 by 12 at Michael's for the full price. I didn't have a 40% off, so I went ahead and I got it. So, let's see. Right there, my heat gun had been on for way too long and the, the gel had melted in there. Alright, so there I am using Jolie's Boutique Flowers. Um, I have had these ones for a while now. And I finally got around to using it, the flowers. And I have a couple more. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm getting into the scrapbooking again. So then I'm going to use my Recollection um, Adhesive Rhinestones, which I love these things. I, I swear, I go through it like nothing. I only have the ones that I just got um, two days ago. I just bought it, and it's almost gone. So, um... Now I'm using the, in the dollar fifty sections at Michael, they have this trims and they also have like pretty rhinestones and stuff like that. Um, but I wanted to use the blue because it matches with the paper on the bottom and it's so beautiful. So I went ahead and I used this trims. So if you haven't gone to Michael's in a while, go ahead. They have really nice stuff in the dollar fifty section. Um, just really, really nice things. And now I'm going to use some of my, um, I believe one of those is Wild Orchid Craft and the other ones are I Am Roses. I really can't tell the difference anymore because I just put them all together. I took them out of the package. Um, but I know one of them is Wild Orchid Craft for sure. And then my glue, my fabric glue wasn't working. But I got it to work and then the video went dead. So this is the, the, the finishing, the finished picture, and I hope you guys like it. Also, um, if you liked the video and was helpful to you, please like and subscribe for more videos. Also, if you have any suggestions on what type of video you'd like to see me do, leave a comment down below. And thank you for watching. I enjoyed making this video, and... Um, just have a beautiful and scrappy day. Mwah.
拜。